hails from Harbor City, California. She plays the piano, guitar, and violin, lessons of which she has been teaching since a very young age. On her free time, she likes to draw, read, and spend time with family. She enjoys skateboarding, going to the beach, and watching movies. She dreams to be an oncologist one day. Candidate number two, Daniela Ancheta. Please welcome to the stage, candidate number three, Precious Onyo. 17 years of age, Precious will be graduating high school this coming semester and will be attending nursing school shortly after. Basketball is her sport, which she learned from her dad. She enjoys modeling, business, and creating content as a social media influencer on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube where she has hundreds of thousands of followers. Candidate number three, Precious Onyo. Please welcome to the stage, candidate number four, Ashley Gagliardo. Ashley's 15 years old, currently a sophomore in high school. She is the third of seven children. She loves to sing, dance, model. She's a gold medalist in Jiu-Jitsu at the Martial Art Academy, which she attended for two years. On her free time, she loves to read books about astronomy and express herself through makeup. Ashley has always been intrigued with science and she hopes to land in NASA one day. Candidate number four, Ashley Gagliardo. Give her a round of applause. is 15 years old. This is Elizabeth Munoz. She is the youngest of three siblings. She plays volleyball and softball and considers herself outgoing and online. She has a passion for journaling, journaling, and I do all my play journalism. <laughs> and it sets herself in focus. She tutors those struggling with her, their English work at school. Always ready to give someone a helping hand. She believes that you can spread love and positivity with a simple smile or compliment. Candidate number five, Elizabeth Oriose. Please welcome to the stage candidate number six, Margaret Piatos. Actually, we're going to go with seven. I forgot. We do not have a number six because Margaret is no longer with us. She did not compete. My apologies. Candidate number seven, Irma Trinidad. Irma, the second of three children, hails from Chicago. She is 14 years old and a varsity athlete in multiple sports. As an athlete, she has been honored with accolades and recognition for her skills, agility, and her technical thinking. Among her peers, she is committed to promoting an active lifestyle and the value of working together to achieve a goal. Candidate number seven, Irma Trinidad. And there you have it, Miss Young Philippines USA 2023 candidates. And now for our Miss Philippines USA category, we have number eight, Gia Alfano. or CSI related. This is candidate number eight, Gia Alfaro. Candidate number nine, Arabella Barr. Arabella is 19 and was born and raised in San Jose, California. She has a small business called Aloha Crown, where she customizes tacos and legs. For seven years now, she's been a dancer with the Loka High Polynesian Dance Group. She teaches the younger students about Polynesian dance and culture and has performed in Disneyland, Disney World, and for the Golden State Warriors, Arabella Barr. Candidate number 10 is Christine Villanez. 
Christine holds a master's degree in business administration with a specialization in hospitality management. She graduated with honors at Elliott's International University and is currently a sales agent for Miss Harris Couture in downtown LA. Her interests include modeling, dancing, and playing chess. She also has established her own food cart business, Angel Food Trip, selling Filipino food, which was conceived as a response to the pandemic. This is candidate number 10, Christine Villanis. Welcome to the stage now, candidate number 11, Joanne Rue. Joanne is 24. She was born and raised in Riverside, California. Her interests and hobbies include cooking, singing, and traveling, working two jobs. She is very independent, family-oriented, and preserving her culture is a vital value of her life. And as such, she has strived to frequent the Philippines to keep close to her Filipino roots. Brian is also a first degree black belt in Taekwondo. Candidate number 11, Glenn Cruz. Candidate 12 is Mia Davis. Mia is 19 and currently a student at the California State University East Bay. At the school, she works at the Cupcake Shop in Hayward, California, where she makes cupcakes and other desserts. At school, she's majoring in early childhood development and minoring in studio art. She's always loved art and aspires to be an elementary school teacher one day. This is candidate number 12, Mia Davis. the social media director for our school's student association. She's also a dance instructor at Rising Stars Performing Arts Studio where she took vocal, dance, flute, and piano lessons as a child. She loves going to meetings along with working on and learning more about cars and interest producing introduced to her by her parents. And at number 13, we have a Josephine Diesel. Number 14 is Mary J. Pizarta. They were from Cary, North Carolina. Mary J. recently graduated from North Carolina State University as a valedictorian and summa cum laude. She graduated with a degree in human biology and just applied to medical school. Her dream is to be a doctor and provide care to vulnerable and marginalized populations. Her hobbies include reading, Pilates, and commercial modeling. This is candidate 14, Mary J. Felizarta. Welcome candidate number 15, Hannah Gilmore. at the California State University Channel Islands. She has a passion for singing, dancing, hip-hop, and her talent has been showcased in several opening acts of celebrated Filipino artists during their U.S. concert. Candidate number 15, Anna Yoder. currently attending Moore Park Community College. She'll transfer to CSU Channel Islands in the fall to pursue a bachelor's degree in business marketing. In her free time, she engages in motorsports, particularly drifting, and the future of tools to manage her career doing social media and digital marketing. This is candidate number 16, Azul Hef. Oh, 